Kafue National Park is the largest national park in Zambia, covering an area of about 22,400 square kilometers, similar in size to Wales or Massachusetts. It is the second largest park in Africa and is home to over 55 different species of mammals. The park is named for the Kafue River. It stretches over three provinces, northwestern, central and southern. The main access is via the Great West Road from Lusaka to Mongu which crosses the park north of its center. Seasonal dirt roads also link from Coloma and Namwala in the south and southeast, and Kasempa in the north. History Kafue National Park was established in 1924 after the British colonial government moved the traditional owners of the area, the Nkoya people of King M. Ween Kabulwebulwe, from their traditional hunting grounds into the Mumba district to the east. Dissatisfaction with the pace of development in Central Province and a lack of benefit from tourism in the park have led to calls from Nkoya leaders to establish a new province in the area which they have proposed to call Kafue Province. Fauna Kafu has a superb range of antelopes as well as large herds of red lechwe and puku, with smaller groups of zebras and blue wildebeest in the Busanga Plains around June, when it starts to dry out. Across the northern half of the park, there's a good range of mixed bush environments. Kudus, bushbucks, elands, reedbucks, dikers, racebucks and defasa waterbucks are all frequently seen in Kafu. Lions are relatively widespread all over the park, but the larger males are increasingly uncommon, with inevitable consequences for numbers as a whole. Pride stalk through nervous herds of pukus and lechways nightly, using the natural drainage ditches for cover with deadly efficiency on the Busanga Plains. The Kafu River and its tributaries themselves are a hive of activity and home to pods of hippopotami and a few of the largest crocodiles in southern Africa. Elephants are commonly seen particularly along the Kafue River and around Lake Itezitezi. Leopards remain very common throughout the main forested areas of this park, though they are seldom seen on the open plains. Spotted hyenas are seen regularly, though not often, throughout the park. Cheetahs are not common anywhere, but they are most frequently seen in the north of this park, where they seem to be thriving. Occasional sightings of Cape wild dogs occur all over the park which is one of Zambia's best strongholds for them. Since 2005, the protected area is considered a lion conservation unit together with South Luangwa National Park. Physical environment The country is generally flat or gently undulating apart from some small, steep porphyritic granite hills between Changa and Ngoma and occasional sandstone and granite hills around Ngoma rising to 120 metres 390 feet. The southwestern part of the Hook Granite Massif underlies the central part of the park, including schist, gneiss, granite gneiss and granite. On the edge of the granite massif there are slates, quartzites and limestones from the Katanga sediments of the inner Lufilian arc. To the north and south of the massif the soil covers Karoo sediments of shales, siltstones, concreted gravels and various types of laterite. In the northern end of the park the flood plains have clay soils, but otherwise the soils are strongly leached sandy to loamy soils with low fertility. In most of the drainage of the Nanzilla River, and in some of the lands around the Nikala, Musa and Lawansanza rivers, there are dark grey alkaline clays. Otherwise, the park is covered by well-drained and relatively infertile pale or orange Kalahari sands mixed with some silt and clay. Mean annual rainfall varies from 510 mm in, in the south to more than 1,020 mm in, in the north. The annual mean temperature is 21 degrees Celsius 70 degrees Fahrenheit, with a mean maximum from 26 degrees Celsius 79 degrees Fahrenheit in July to 33 degrees Celsius 91 degrees Fahrenheit in October, the hottest month of the year. Winds are mostly light, blowing from the east. In November to February there are about 5 hours of sunshine daily, and in June to September about 9 hours of sunshine daily. Ecoregions and habitats 
Most of the park lies in the central Zambezian Miombo woodlands ecoregion characterized by savanna grasslands with Miombo tree species, growing thickly in some patches, with a few small dambos grasslands which become marshy in the rainy season interspersed among them. In the south there are stony hills and rocky outcrops where the sparser Zambezian and Mopane woodlands ecoregion takes over, and Mopane trees adapted to hotter drier conditions replace Miombo. A thin belt of evergreen forest lines the banks of the Kafu River, which has been controversially dammed just outside the park at Itezi Tezi Dam, forming a reservoir within the park. Patches of Bakiaya and Cryptospalum evergreen forest occur in the south and west. The jewel in Kafu's crown however is the Zambezian flooded grasslands ecoregion in the north, including the Busanga Swamp and Plains. These support large herds of herbivores and their predators. In the dry season the animals keep close to the swamps and marshy creeks and are easily seen. The area is also noted for its birdlife. Ngoma in the south is the headquarters of the park but this area together with the Nangila Plains are less visited since the Itezi Tezi Dam was built and more lodges were developed in the north. The reservoir cut the north-south track through the park and used to make it necessary to detour outside the park to drive between Ngoma and Chunga. The completion of the spinal road once again links the north and south of the park. Topic Notes. This park is considered for inclusion in the Five Nation Kavango Zambezi Transfrontier Conservation Area. Topic See also. Wildlife of Zambia